Jonathan Lee Riches, a.k.a. JLR. I got breaking news, people. Uh, just spoke with the Hawkins County Humane Society. They told me that they are meeting with Hawkins County Sheriff Detective John Pruitt, who is going there tomorrow, about discussing to get those animals rescued at the Wells property. The Humane Society told me they're very concerned about the videos that they recently saw about the dogs not looking proper, malnutritioned, they looked hungry. They are going to speak to John Pruitt tomorrow to discuss how they can get those four dogs. They, she told me four dogs, four dogs on that property, off that property, legally, legally off that property. Uh, they told me that John Pruitt was attending a funeral today. He's going to go there tomorrow and they're going to discuss a strategy whether they're going to communicate with the Wells to have them surrender the remaining animals on that property or they're going to use legal methods to be able to legally take those animals and save those animals off that property. As we all know, for months, there's we've been posting videos and showing that the dogs on that property are being neglected. There's dogs running around loose on that property, breeding, not being fed. We went there multiple times to feed the dogs. The Humane Society actively wants to help these dogs. They are not, you know, for not helping. They, they are doing their best. They have offered worm shots and all kinds of vaccinations for these dogs. They said they went up there recently with a pickup truck to feed these dogs. But the concern is that the dogs on the Wells property are just being left there uh, while Candace is out running around loose somewhere in, 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 in around the area. She's not there. Grandis is there and not there. No one is taking care of these animals. So it takes us. It takes us concerned citizens seeing proof and documented proof about these animals being abused and neglected. Dead dog there recently. Uh, another dead dog I heard prior. Uh, another YouTuber went and took one of the puppies off the property out of concern. This is a major concern you know, as citizens, we love animals. We want to make sure cats and dogs are, are, are properly safe and in good care. Candace and Don Wells do not deserve any dogs on that property. Uh, total neglect, abuse. I've heard horror stories from friends, former friends of Don and Candace Wells saying that Don used to shoot the dog with the BB guns. You know, they would die. They would just throw them off the side of the mountain. No care whatsoever. I personally seen dogs running around the uh, 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 streets in that area. You know, Beach Beach Creek is a very busy road. Somebody could get hurt, not only with the dogs running around loose, but they could run into a car and a car could, you know, go off. There's the, the, the roads there are very narrow, you know, and, and, and go down. A car could swerve off because one of their dogs on loose and, and, and get a driver killed or get somebody killed. Uh, enough is enough. Hopefully these dogs finally get rescued and no animals are on that property. No animals are on that property. It, thank you, everyone that's been in concern. But again, do not harass the Hawkins County Humane Society. I've been communicating with them, talking with dialogue. I actually donated them food uh, recently through Amazon Smile. So they, they're, they're getting that. Other people uh, have been sending them donations for, do, uh, for dogs. Because remember... The Humane Society there is a non-profit 501c. They are not animal control. Hawkins County does not have an animal control. So maybe it's up to us to step to the plate and try to lobby officials there to get an animal control in that county to protect the animals uh, from being abused, abandoned, and neglected. We can do our part by you know influencing these local officials there to get an animal control there so you can save animals because... It's, it's animal lives matter, you know, animal lives matter. So good news. We'll wait to see what happens. But, you know, the ball is rolling. The ball is rolling and hopefully the, the remaining animals there could be saved and off that property and, and put into proper homes, uh, you know, non-kill shelter. And then somebody can adopt them and, and give them a good quality life that these animals deserve. Justice for Summer Wells. Hopefully Summer Wells is found soon. Hopefully the animals 
are going to be safe. So God bless.